my name is Mike Cole. Uh, I've been using the Numa for close to two years now, right out two years, and uh, loving every minute of it. So I've been using rotaries probably ten years, and uh, to have access to a rotary that is so close to a, a coil, um, just the punch that it has, it just packs packs it in there. You don't have to wrestle with it. You don't have to. Uh, I don't know with with other rotaries. It just seems like you have to wrestle with it and stretch extra hard, you know, stretch the skin hard. So it it just makes it more difficult, you know, with the Numa, it's, you just don't have to wrestle with it. It seems to exit when it needs to exit. It doesn't stay in there too long. Um, with other rotaries, and they're very punchy, you know, when you're moving quick, like I said, if you have more experience in using it, you, you're quicker with hand motion. You know, other rotaries would, almost like they're catching. So with this one, it seems to, get in and out like it's supposed to and it causes less trauma. I'm getting crazier heel times, like super nice heel times, like two, three days it's peeling. The uh, cams, I've tried probably three different ones. Um, I like, uh, my, my preference is the, it's the 20, cause it's, you know, has more punch. Cause you know, I, I've been tattooing a long time. So I, you know, the, my hand motion is really fast. So, uh, you know, with, with a, a cam like that, it's just, you know, it's, it's very punchy, so you need to keep the hand motion pretty quick. As far as the grip, I prefer the shift, because you, you can, you can, uh, there's multiple positions on the, on the grip that you can use, to, especially when you're working on an arm and you don't want to turn the client. Uh, the shift grip lets you kind of back up a little bit and just rest your hand on the armrest, and you don't, you don't have to necessarily move the client, because you can move your hand. The steel motor assembly, with the aluminum shift, it puts the center of mass in, into the uh, palm of the hand better. So you have a, I don't know, it's just a nicer, more comfortable, again, the word ergonomic uh, for the wrist. There is situations where you kind of like the heavier. Like if I'm working on a, a, a torso where the client's flat and I'm, you know, like this, it, the, the weight doesn't bother the wrist as much. So it's actually a nice, because the, the vibration with both the steel motor assembly and the steel shift grip uh, is a nice, it reduces the vibration a lot. You know? And uh, if you're working on a, you know, a nice flat surface, it definitely doesn't stress the uh, the wrist out, especially on the back, back here. Um, and it's, just, I, I do love the, uh, the lack of vibration. It does super absorb it. The, uh, both steel shift grip. Cons? I haven't found any. I haven't found any. I mean, I think it's super versatile. It's ridiculously versatile, with the, with, especially with the cam, the different grips. You know, you have lighter cams for softer, like I said, uh, smoother, soft black and gray realism. Uh, if you want to color pack, neo-traditional, new school, like anything. With a coil, it's probably the best rotary to go to if you want to, if you're thinking about switching, if you're having hand problems, or you just want something that's more uh, reliable. Uh, we don't have to tune it; it just works. Uh, I'm looking forward to doing a, a grip with Numa. It's a straight uh, cylinder. It's got no no curves or stuff like that to it. It's like an old school cylinder kind of grip with. Uh, glyphy kind of computer language in there that I'm known for, I guess. Um, as far as trying to pick out what's, what's gonna work best, I mean, you obviously have to try to try things to know if you don't wanna get stuck in that, but yeah, when you do find the, that magical combo that which Numa offers such a nice variety of uh, different, you know, steel and aluminum and different cams it's when you find that one it's it is magical but don't get stuck in that <laughs>